Hello everyone and welcome back to a brand new video from Buried One. Today we are going to discuss the GPUs you can use for Ethereum mining. I only do the ones we can really use, not the ones that are 5 years old or something. So let's get on with Nvidia first. First of all we have the GPU from Nvidia GTX 970. It uses 140 watts and it hashes about 16 to 23 mega hashes per second. That means you have 7 watts per mega hash. It comes at the price of $280. Next up we have the GTX 980. It uses 165 watts. It hashes at about 20 mega hashes per second. Uh, that's about 8.25 watts per mega hash per second. <laughs> price comes at a $360. Uh, range. Next up we have the GPU NVIDIA 750Ti with a wattage of only 60. It hashes at about 5 mega hashes per second, uses 12 watts per mega hash. The price is only $100. Next up we have the GPU NVIDIA 780Ti, uses 250 watts, hashes at 15 mega hashes per second, uses 16.6 watts per mega hash. Uh, the price? I see $900. Yeah, this is a rare piece, I guess. Next up, we have the NVIDIA 1070. It uses only 150 watts. It hashes at about 20 to 40 mega hashes. This one is unconfirmed. This might be just a flop. I'm not really sure if this one's true. I haven't seen it. I only seen some numbers on the internet, so if it changes, don't kill me in the comments, please. So if it would do that, it would be a 7.5 watt per mega hash or a 3.75 watt per mega hash per second only. It comes at a price at about $450. Next up, we have the GPU NVIDIA 1080. Wattage, 10, uh, 180 wattage and it hashes at about 5 to 27 mega hashes per second. Also for this one, I can't confirm it, I'm sorry about that. But if it does, we have a 36 watt per mega hash or a 6.66 uh, watt per mega hash. The price is variant and I've seen it for $700. Next up we go to the AMD cards. Well, use AMD. People always know that Nvidia is really against of doing Ethereum. They only go for gaming, so they kind of messed it up. So go for AMD. It's a way better car, so you'll see in a second. So first of all, we have the GPU R9 390. It uses 275 watts, but it hashes at 31 mega hash per second. That's equal to 8.8 .8 watts per mega hash. It comes at a low price of $300. Next up we have the GPU R9290X. It uses a stunning 300 watts. It hashes at 30.5 mega hashes per second. It uses 9.8 watts per mega hash. Price $250. Next up we have the GPU R9280X. It uses 250 watts. That's um, a mega hash rate of 25 mega hash per second. That's equal to 10 watts per mega hash per second. It comes at a price of $320. Next up we have the GPU R9270X. Uh, it has 180 watts, hashes at 11 mega hash per second. That's equal to 16.3 watts per mega hash. It comes at a price of $250. It's totally not worth it. I <laughs> hope you guys enjoyed the video and if you want uh, more information about cards, I'll put in a link in the description of a website that knows um, many options of Windows 7 to Windows 10 on each GPU and AMD NVIDIA cards. So everything you need is over there. But I just made a quick video about some graphics cards you can buy to start your mining rig. Hope you guys enjoyed. See you guys next time.